All right, welcome, welcome, welcome. We are here at AWS reInvent live at the Citrix booth, and I'm joined by my good friend, Kevin Binder. Kevin, hey, welcome. Hey. <laughs> Kevin, at AWS reInvent, you must be getting a lot of questions about Amazon Web Services and Citrix Cloud. Yes. So what are people asking you and what's the vibe? Yeah. Um, hey, we've had a lot of traffic in the booth. It's been great. Um, we've seen some common themes. And you know, when I look at what some of the questions are, we get questions like, how does Citrix Cloud compare to AWS? What we're recommending them do is we want them to understand Citrix Cloud is really about the workspace platform. Most of our customers are going through some sort of a transformation where they're either already want running workloads in the cloud or are in the process of moving workloads from on-prem to the cloud. And we don't want to limit that choice or penalize them for selecting one cloud vendor over the other. So we're at AWS, AWS is great. Um, there are other cloud providers as well. And so we remain agnostic. We want to give a great experience. We don't want to limit choice. And, and you know, different cloud platforms are, are often chosen for a specific reason. Some applications do better on some cloud platforms versus the other, depending on what type of application you're trying to deliver. So you heard it here, live from AWS reInvent, for an agnostic, transformative experience at Citrix Cloud Management Plane. There you go. And then your workloads, not only can they run on-prem today still, right? Wherever you want. Or up in any cloud, including AWS. AWS. And Azure and Google, some of the other ones. All right. Live from AWS reInvent. That does it for me. Shondo on the go. My good buddy, Kevin Binder. Thanks, Sean. Thanks, buddy. All right. Bye-bye, everybody.